Good morning, everyone, and welcome to another edition of Traveling with Sam. Um, today, we are going to uh, explore the lovely city of Belgrade, Serbia. So if you're ready, I'm ready. Let's go. This is today's breakfast. Got some cereal, egg, uh, some sandwiches, uh, salad and some kind of pastry with uh, some coffee. And what is a typical breakfast in your country? This is where I'm staying in Serbia, Arka Barka. And you can see it's uh, floating on the water, which is uh, very unique and interesting. Got other um, ones over there. Here we are, the sun's coming out, walking through this lovely giant park. Another one, different from last night. Our first stop is this fortress in Zemon. It's really old, but awesome. have a view from the tower and look at the longest river in Europe, the Danube. This tower is over a hundred years old, approximately a hundred and thirty years old. Look at this cool fortress. Let's explore. Pretty interesting and pretty spectacular to look at here. So this is what they call War Island. Uh, you can't get there unless you have a boat. Uh, it's mainly for locals and um, wildlife. It's like a national park. And here we are in uh, the old city and the upper part of the fortress where they did battle. And uh, some of these walls are still the original form from the Ottoman Empire from the 12th century. So really old. And what are some old things in your city or country? This is one of the most important uh, monuments here in Belgrade, Serbia. So this statue symbolizing a hero, got sword in one hand, pigeon in other, for like friendship. And uh, he's looking out from the old Belgrade to the new Belgrade. Here's the open air uh, war museum. The partisan basketball court and the red court over here. Serbia is known for their basketball teams and uh, their national team is one of the best in the world uh, behind probably only the NBA which for those that don't know is the American Basketball League, USA Basketball League. Of the, any of the NBA players uh, from Serbia played on this court called the Red Court. Obviously, you can see why it's called the Red Court. <laughs> the biggest temple uh, in Europe. A closer look.
Do you have temples in your country or city? So here we are. Here's the front of this massive temple. And now we're going to go check out the inside. Look at how massively tall these doors are. All right, let's go inside now. Wow, check it out. Is this a temple or what? Look at how massive it is. Just incredible. Have you ever seen anything like this? If so, where? And here's a little cute little church next door to the massive temple. So the population here in uh, Belgrade, Serbia is um, 1.8 million people, but there's an additional 1 million people who uh, travel from nearby villages and cities to come work. So within a day, there could be up to about 3 million people. So please like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And until next time, thanks for traveling with Sam. Bye.